Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying three items that were sent to us from George Ann in Illinois. Thank you very much to George Ann. George Ann actually ordered these from Publishers Clearinghouse, and they came in uh, tins, like a tin that you would store candy in, and we just took them out of the tin and they're in bags. So the company that is doing this for Publishers Clearinghouse is called Weaver Nut Company, and they're located in Pennsylvania. And apparently they do nuts, candy, dried fruit, and chocolate. So today we're gonna to be trying the Deluxe S'mores Bites. And these are the Salted Caramel Bites, and these are Maple Walnut Chews. Which sounds wonderful. Okay, so Deluxe S'mores Bites. It says seven pieces are 140 calories. And they're not individually wrapped, so you have to put them in a dish or something. Yes. Or a Ziploc bag. I'm saying if you wanted to put them out. Yes, yes. They're uh, crunchier than I thought they would be. They're not one Or harder. I have the texture of the marshmallow. It's kind of a chewy marshmallow. Mm -hmm. I don't really get chocolate though. I got a little graham. It reminds me of a, it does remind me of s'mores that we've had in other things. Like, yeah. Like we've had, a, it, honestly, it's like a your basic chocolate covered marshmallow. That's yeah, what it's reminding me of. That's what it really is. Yeah. And they're, they're kind of, they're not bad. You hear it like that and you think, oh, that's going to be really hard. It's not. Mm -hmm. You put it in your mouth, it just crumbles. Yes, it crumbles. Uh, but honestly, that's what it tastes like. It just tastes like a, a chocolate covered marshmallow. Yeah, it doesn't taste like your traditional s'more. No, I do get a little bit of that graham flavor, that right. graham cracker flavor, but not like super strong. We have had though that same flavor, I think in other companies that have tried to replicate s'mores. And a lot of times that's what you're getting is a, that's what they're calling s'mores. It's just your chocolate covered marshmallow. That's what it tastes like, but it's yeah, good. It's good. I don't have any complaints about it. Uh, these are the salted caramel bites. Uh, one ounce, 28 grams is 120 calories. So you just have to weigh them. They look like little, little caramel balls, really. Mmm. Mm. They're crunchy. Mm -hmm. Neither one of us expected mm. that. It's almost like a malted milk ball texture. Almost. Mm -hmm. That Between that and a cookie. It's kind of got that kind of... you going to bite one in half? I am. I was hoping he would. Yeah. It's like, oh wow. It ends on a really sweet, 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 salty, yeah. It's a pretzel, isn't it? Is it a pretzel? It might be a pretzel. Hmm. Is that a pretzel? That's a pretzel. That's why it had salt. I said it ended sweet and salty. You're getting all that salt from the pretzel. Yeah. I wonder why they didn't call them salted caramel pretzel, pretzel bites. bites. Mm. They Maybe left the out, original packaging does have that. That's just what they call them when they repackage. Yeah, they left out the word pretzel. That's yeah. what they are. Though. It's really a sweet and salty pretzel. I don't really even get really a caramel necessarily, but I like. It's, I love the texture. Yeah, it's very, very. Uh, to me, I, I do get caramel. It's just not like a cooked caramel. It's just an incredibly sweet caramel. It, yeah. But yes, they're they're sweet. They're crunchy. They're any if you even if you like had trouble with your teeth, you would have no problem eating these at all because it's just a it's just a crunchy pretzel, but it's not hard at all. No, those are delicious. Those are good. It tastes more to me. It tastes more like a like a heated up cooked sugar, not a caramel with like the I, I see what you're saying. Yeah. 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 And these are individually wrapped. Oh my gosh. Smell. Like maple nut goody. Yeah. It smells like a maple nut goody if you've ever had Brock's maple nut goodies. This is maple walnut chews. Four pieces is 160 calories. Oh. It's like a caramel caramel. Do we open one? Mm-hmm. I can take care of it after I take the picture. 
That's good. It smells stronger than it is. Mm -hmm. The flavor. It's not. It's good. It's nice. I taste the maple. I taste the walnut. Mm -hmm. I actually like Brock's better. If I was the maple nut goodies. Yeah. If I yeah. was to choose between the two, that's just the. Well, there's a difference though. A maple nut goodie has like a a firmer uh, sugar coating yeah. on the outside. It's really more of a candy. Than it's a more caramel. of a candy. Yes. This is a caramel. You really can't compare the two. It's the flavor-wise. Right. It's the same flavor, but they're offering it to you in a different way. This is actually in a like a caramel consistency, and it's it's chewy. Whereas that I I like the uh, the crisper texture. I love the texture better of the Brock's. This is a good flavor though. It you is good. You do get it all. Yeah. You get I, the maple. I think it's the the sweetness of the maple and the mm -hmm. caramel is not as sweet. As the maple. As the maple. So yes, you're not getting as much. So you're left with a lot of walnut flavor. Mm -hmm. um, I like them. I like the caramel bites better. That, that would be my like, choice. Yeah, that would be my choice. Uh, these are delicious. Um, and and if they're, I don't know if on their website or if they're if Georgia had ordered out of a book or whatever. If they told her these were pretzels. If they're not telling people that they're pretzels, then they're doing themselves a disservice because. That's really, really good. Yeah, People go. love uh, a coated pretzels, you know? Um, but let me see. I think these would be my number one. These, the, the maple, would be my number two. And then this, I'm going to choose the s'mores last. Yeah, I'd probably do the same. Yeah. But these are good. I think it's cool. I think the s'mores are good. They're just plainer. Yeah, it's neat that, that Georgia Jam was able to order these from Publishers Clearinghouse because I didn't even know that was a thing that you could do. So I think it's awesome. Uh, but if you can order any of them, I don't know how much they cost. I would definitely order. They're, they're calling them Salted Caramel Bites. So I hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.